You ready? We are ready. Hello everybody, welcome back to Anderson's TV. I am Pete, as always. Um, it's another unboxing video. I love these things. Um, because it is just the genuine surprise. Was that, did I say that word right? The gen, genuine, the gen, I'll do that all again, genuine. <laughs> Today we are back with another unboxing video and this one is a kind of a special one because this guitar there's only one of in Europe as far as I know and there's only 39 of these guitars made right I'm not going to say what it is yet but of course it gives it away where it's from ESP it says on the box um, but I think um, instead of me just rambling on and all that stuff but before I unbox please like and subscribe Hit the notification bell and click up there for more funny unboxing videos. Anyway, let's uh, unbox this guitar so we can see what's in it. I should be very careful because this guitar, uh, even with those things, I think I should be careful because this guitar is expensive. It's very expensive. I felt like I was kicking my duvet off there in the middle of the night when I was too warm. <laughs> right, so... Um, this might give it away a little bit. So this is the ESP Hatsune Miku uh, guitar. And as I said, there's 39 of these ever made in the ESP custom shop factory. I'm not going to do this while I speak because it's going to be noisy. Hang on, one second. Look at that! The pink logo. The pink logo. Check it out. It's pretty epic. Yeah. So this is this is this is such a limited guitar, and we checked out the internet, right, and YouTube, and all the places, and there is not. We couldn't find anything where someone has unboxed one of these and gone through the goodies or even played a G chord on the guitar. There's, there's some of them out there, but that's the grassroots uh, version of this. So the more affordable version that is uh, uh, limited, just to, or it's just made for Japan market. But this one is the only one. So if you, <laughs> if you want one of these, the links will be below or the link for this guitar will be below. And I mean, 39. So this is one of 39, so I'm going to see what the serial number is. I don't even know what that is, but it's really cool. I just love unboxing guitars because it's just fun. And not even, it's not even mine. I just still think it's amazing. <laughs> so here we go. Ooh, it's a cool shape, man. Number one. That's soon to be cool. Well, let's see. Let's um, let's let's get it back down here so I can get it out. So it's only the 39 first of these comes with the case, and <laughs> that's a cool shape, man, isn't it? Thick. Yeah, so it's thick. So it's it's slightly five mil thicker than a normal body apparently. So the the, the body is slightly wider here. And it's a three-piece maple neck with a rosewood board on it. Let's just take this off. Oh, nice. Nice piece of rosewood. And I love these little inlays. I mean, I'm not a, um, an anime guy. You know, I just, I'm a blues guy, you know. But <laughs> I'm sure you can play blues on this anyway. Uh, but, I mean, it's one of 39. I like it. I think it's cool. You know, I wouldn't. I didn't know what to expect when I opened this guitar, Rob. I've just seen a picture of it. I like that the little, the, so the the tuners are kind of inlaid into the into the this piece that's on top of the headstock with the pink ESP logo. Got locking tuners on there. Goto tuners. There you go. Serial number thirty-five. This one is. Um, I like this little. Racing stripes. Racing stripes, and this little pink line here, zero one. You got a Wilkinson Goto uh, trem system on there. You got Seymour Duncan pickups in here as well. So it's all the good stuff, you know. It's all the good stuff. Um, let's see what's in the case. I'm not expecting much in the way of candy, but let's have a look. The case is candy. 
on its own. Got a little Velcro there. So here you, uh, here you got your uh, certificate of authenticity. Uh, serial number 35. Uh, this document uh, certifies that the artist signature series guitar is manufactured to the artist's specifications by joint development with the artist and ESP Co. Limited. Um, so what do we get in here? We get a uh, delivered to you it's our sincerest thanks from Anderson. So it's a picture of Lee and a picture of me. Thank you very much. And it's been expected by us, and it's all okay. Uh, you get some uh, Wilkinson Goto VS100N operation manual. So if you don't know how to use that, that's in there. <laughs> you get some tools and some locking nuts for the straps. You get um, the arm, which I'm going to stick on because I am going to play it because we haven't seen anywhere else online where anyone is playing this guitar. And then you get keys for the for the case, so you can lock it up. Uh, I mean, this is this guitar is definitely a collector's guitar because, um, as I said, it's not cheap. Links below. Um, but you know, if you got if there's 39 of these and if you've got the money and you're a big fan, then why not? You know, I would you know I would do it. But so we hear what it sounds like, what these Seymour Duncan sounds like. I think so. <laughs> okay, so let's hear what it sounds like. Um, I'm probably not going to play anything like uh, Hasune Miku does live. You can probably go on YouTube and just type it in. He's got a proper band and there's a big hologram of her uh, standing in the middle playing. It's, it's quite a... and there's like thousands of people. It's incredible. It's, it's just incredible. And you know what? The guitar looks wicked. I like the shape. I like the fact that it's got this little lip on it. Like, um, it's, it's almost like a... Um, it's almost like a firebird or some kind of thing where it's got that raised lip in the middle. Um, let's see what, see what Duncan pickup sounds like and I would assume there's no... Oh! Splits as well! Wow, there we go, so... Super easy to play, really nice. And it splits. Middle position. And there's, you can split either of these. There's a bridge. Ooh, that's that's pokey, that's very pokey. Let's see what it does with a bit of gain.
Well, so there you go. That is the uh, Hatsune Miku ESP. I mean, I am... This is why I love my job, right? Because one day I'm playing a Squire, the next day I'm playing a Les Paul from the Murphy Lab, and then I'm playing an Ibanez something and this stuff. And today I'm playing one of these guitars that's one of 39. And some guy out there, a girl out there, will buy this guitar and it'll be the guitar they've always looked for. They go, I want one of those, Why? I can't find one. We've got one. It's right here, and it's got serial number 35, and I'll make sure it gets all nice and cleaned up and polished up and put back in a case, and we send out just to you. And then when you do, please take pictures and tag us so we can see that you got it. All right? Well, um, one last thing, because it wouldn't be a um, Hatsune Miku video and a Hatsune Miku guitar without using a Miku pedal. So... I have to use the Miku stomp um, just because, otherwise I'm sure you will go, why didn't you pluck that guitar in with that pedal? So here you go. So thank you very much for watching and uh, links are below for this guitar. Please like and subscribe and I will see you in the next video. Take care.